Hey guys, so I'm back, and uh, uh, I just want all I want to say is uh, subscribe because on this channel I play skin games, I play Rust, I upload everything because see what it's like. But I've tried this two times, and I, I have to read. The, I have to. Welcome to Joy. Joy. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this place. I'd pick up the pace if I were you. Yeah, to read Ugh, this. Not very magical there. looking, is it? I read this so many times. The Reaper Nurses did not take kindly to me snooping around the restricted areas. In the end, even my, with my abilities, there were too many of them. I did not find an exit or anything I could use to restore my memory. After the jump, I couldn't move. I was paralyzed with pain and could only stare at the ground, waiting for the air to put past. As I opened my eyes, I saw that I was on top of some, something large and metallic. It was a giant medallion of some sort and had animals on it, a rabbit, a pig, and a chicken to be precise. Suddenly, I heard a voice yell to me from above. The voice sounded friendly, but I could feel the machine um, malice behind it. I, st I staggered to my feet and looked up. Before me was a massive castle facade. It was like something out of, uh, out of an amusement park. A large yellow rabbit was dancing on a platform while the dr above the drawbridge gate. It looked like some sort of twisted mascot. I, c I could tell immediately that this was one of the this one was different from the others. It was a killing machine, one built pur purely for violence and chaos. There was a soul of some sort inside the machine, but it was not human. I tried to run from the rabbit, but didn't get far. I was stopped by another mascot, a pig. It attacked me and missed, obliterating the side of the castle wall in the process to, uh, and leaving a large hole. In a blind panic, I tried to use the little relic to escape, but the rabbit grabbed me violently from behind and lifted me uh, up by the throat, strangling me in the air while laughing man maniacally. It took a it took a loose brick to the face to start it enough to allow me to break free. My landing was not a soft one. I landed sideways on the sharp rubble and bar barbed wire of the brick wall. Severely wounded, I barely escaped by rolling into the moat water below before the rabbit could grab me. The rabbit screamed profanities and threw bricks at me as it disappeared into the cold water of the moat. For some reason, it did not follow me into the water. water. As I sank deeper, the rabbit's voice disappeared entirely and it was silent for a while. At the moment, I felt myself drifting away and my remaining consciousness fading. I no longer even felt the need to breathe. This was uh, this was how it was uh, how it would end. Uh, then suddenly I heard another voice speak uh, out from the depth. It, it, death. it was the demon. Ah, there you are, it said. So much pain, so much despair. Perhaps I can help you more to have an offering that might interest you. All you have to do is take that little toy of yours and leave me out with you. <laughs> when you are ready. <coughs> Sorry. As I heard his words, my eyes opened a bit and saw a demonic red face glaring back at me from the depths. A crushing pain immediately filled my uh, filled my head and twisted words uh, began repeating in my mind. Don't you have someone to kill? They whispered over and over again. Terrified and ignoring my pain, I swam back to the surface in a panic. Conveniently, I discovered that the rabbit and pig were nowhere to be found. I clung to the castle wall and waited, so wondering if the demon in the water would emerge to finish me off. I was careless, and it seemed that the demon had finally noticed my presence. However, nothing happened. Reflecting, I wondered what the demon had meant. I had no idea where to find him, or nor would I be stupid enough to actually go. It would definitely be the end of me. As I uh, wounded as I was, I managed to drag myself after the moat. It's getting harder to find more so long enough to write these notes. I will continue to do it for as long as I have the strength. Oh. Uh, I doubt that the rabbit will be gone for a long day to jump to heal my wounds. To any unfortunate souls that come to this place and find its mission, leave me quickly before it is too late. But that's where this came from. I can order the random sound cut, but I think I'm gonna put that as shorts because I read that too many times and I'm tired of it. That's why it was so like peaceless. Basically, she escaped from the nurses. No, like she, yeah, the nurses did not like the music. Anyway. More lasers and another camera. You know what to do. Stop that rabbit. <laughs> So there's two Easter eggs or secret files. Everyone, I don't what know. I don't know if they're not or if they're cold. Oh! I was glitching! Oh, oh come on! I guess the ticket prices aren't the most painful part Wait, of this experience. Why do I have six lives? I only have. Okay, this is gonna be here. Oh, oh. 
before better. Shut up, Beers. Come on, buddy, you're wasting my time here. Is that all you got? Oh my god, how did I miss that many charge? Wait. Bruh! Terminated. Humanely, I'm sure. Go crush on me, I dare you. Security checkpoint. It is securely locked, right? I think they're looking at you. No sudden movements. Maybe if you don't move, they can't see you. So creepy.
post this video we're going to look at post this video uh we're going to the location of the easter eggs and now if i die, I'll get the easter eggs and yeah skip ahead of time shooting Systems offline. Zone access restricted. Please press power power and zone two. Now this is okay. Well, at least you only have to deal with this one. My entire life. Some kind of control. Everything is That pig looks pretty powerful. It's probably a good idea not to get too close to you. That pig looks pretty powerful. It's probably a good idea not to get too close to you. This game is not fun anymore. It's just not fun. Yeah, I'll, I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll give up. <laughs> <laughs> 